Imagine taking a trip to the edge of the universe at the speed of light, the ultimate speed limit, 300,000 kilometers per second. It's time to take the journey of your life. This video is brought to you by My Astronomy Channel. We are passing the moon after only 1.5 light seconds from departing Venus, just two minutes away from us, Mars. Four minutes we cross Jupiter. After 30 minutes meeting Saturn with its fantastic rings. After one hour of flight, Neptune is our next planet just four hours away. We are now approaching Pluto and its companion Charon just after 5.3 hours. Continuing our journey outward for nearly one year, we come to the Oort cloud, which may contain as many as a trillion comets. Looking back at the Sun, our star eight light minutes away, the Sun is actually a very middle-class star, unique only because of its proximity and importance to us. The next nearest star on our way is Alpha Centauri, a triple star system four light years away. Light year is a distance, not a time. One light year is the distance that light waves travel in a year, about six trillion miles. The Voyager spacecraft, the most sophisticated space missions yet attempted by humans, took years only to get to Jupiter and Saturn. As of 1999 May, Voyager 1 was nearly 6 billion miles from Earth. It takes over 20 hours to send a signal and receive a reply. We are already after one year of flight at the speed of light now. Watching the Orion Nebula, 1500 light years away, visible as the second star in Orion's sword. This gaseous nebula contains a younger cluster of stars, age 1 million years. The Crab Nebula, about 6,000 light years from Earth, is the remnant of a massive star that ended its life in a gigantic supernova explosion in 1054. The Ring Nebula, about 6,000 light years away, is the constellation Lyra, is the final death hiccup of a star like our Sun. The outer layers of the star are ejected as it runs out of nuclear fuel and the hot inner core causes the ejected gas to fluoresce. After 100,000 years, we can now see the full shape of our Milky Way galaxy, which is a system of nearly one trillion stars. It is 100,000 light years across. The sun is about two thirds of the way toward the outer part of the galaxy disk. Our neighbor, the Andromeda galaxy, 2.5 million light years from Earth. This galaxy and our Milky Way make up the dominant galaxies of our local cluster, the local group. We can now see the entire local group of galaxies, which is our own small cluster of about 100 galaxies. After 50 million years of flight, we finally meet the Virgo cluster of galaxies. It's the closest galaxy cluster to the Milky Way. Virgo contains several hundred galaxies. Our local group is an outlying satellite of the Virgo cluster. One billion year passes. Two billion, five billion. The Virgo cluster is now just a tiny dot in the vast dark cosmos. It's only after 10 billion years of traveling at the speed of light that we can finally see the entire universe vast dark huge empty space and we are already homesick it's time to be back home this video is brought to you by my astronomy channel 